Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of, uh, Fatal Frame. Is it here? No, it's here. A little bit there. Go forth. Ah shit, I used 14. I think that's skin. That's skin. That's some skin. Those are skin. That's skin. You guys seeing that? Gross. Uh, watch this. Ancient script engraved on the pedestal. Obtain the four purity stones by the handmaiden's song. Subdue the waking of the priestess in her chamber of needles. <laughs> ah. ah! Don't really know if we want to do all of that, honestly. I'm not sure. I am simply unsure. I don't think there's anywhere else to go, though, right? Where are we right now? Oh, we're in that room. Right. We're in the lower portion. Okay. Because this part was sealed off when Ray was here. So I'm not 100% sure what I'm supposed to be doing with Miku now, but... Must be no attachments. Yeah, that's always the issue, isn't it, though? That's the issue with, like, all of the, um... Shrine Maidens in, like, all of the games. That they, they're they supposed to not have any attachments, and yet they always get attached. Okay, do you need to go up here? This might be another episode where I wander for a bit, because I don't know where I'm going. Are there any items over here? Nope. Any over here? Do you have a book? Nope. Maybe we do have to do it as Miku. I really don't want to. This is where the spooky room is. I don't want to do the spooky room. <laughs> If there's no need for me to do it just yet, I don't want to do it. I still love how she runs down the stairs. It's so great. <laughs> doing? What am I doing as you, Miku? I don't know if I should go down the little shrine hallway thingy or not. I think I might be going the right way, though, because I'm hearing the ting, ting, ting sound of the stakes and the hammers. Sound I can hear the sound of a lullaby coming from somewhere. Oh no. Oh no no. Oh no. Well, okay, listen. <laughs> listen here. You just Listen good. I have cold feet right now. Like literally my tootsies are cold. But I guess we're going to have to uh cuz Miku, I suppose, is just small enough to fit in here where Ray isn't. No! I hate this ghost. Uh, I hate this ghost. This is my least favorite ghost. Besides the blind lady. Okay. She's fucking scary. It's hard to fight her. Double. Um, when shooting, if you continue pressing the X button, you can charge your spirit power in two stages. Shoot by releasing the X button. Greater charge, greater damage. Okay. I think that was the door closing behind me. And I think there's a ghost. Ah! I hate you. Get out of here. Fucking get out of here. 
I did not mean to use the slow ability. I just meant to get rid of you. Oh my god, girl. Look at you. Ah, oh, shit. Ah! <laughs> did I get her? No, I didn't get her. Fuck. Alright, alright. Listen, listen. I don't like you. Get out of here! Oh no! Oh no! Let me go, let me go. I'm switching to 14. Fuck you. Ah. Oh. Okay. Hot an image. She's dead. Switching back. <sighs> She's so spooky, though. Could you imagine being trapped in this freaking crawl space? With a ghost? No, thank you. No, thank you. It's the doll altar. The dalter, if you will. There's the stone that we saw before. On the candle little altar is a beautiful jewel about the size of my palm. Purity stone, L. There's a book on the altar. Gray di green diary. Amane led a man into the shrine. The head of the family is so angry. If the priestess wakes up, the commandment will be broken and the rift will spread. The family head teaches all the handmaidens so hard that they won't forget their duties. The head of the family ordered that Amane be impaled and that her brother be cast out of the manor. Because of the duties of the handmaidens and the duties of the Kuze shrine, there was no other choice. Amane, I'm sorry. Sorry, Amane. Do I have to fight you? I don't want to fight you. Don't make me fight you. Fuck! Alright, girl. Alright, girl. Alright, girl. Did I get that one? Okay. I'm following you, don't worry, girl. Oof. Ah, oh, man. You're over here. Somewhere. Unless you're behind me, but I'm pretty sure you're behind me now. What it sounds like. Are you above me? Nope, nope, nope. Oh shit! Could have sworn that timing was fine. Maybe not. Oop! Ah! 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 Oh man, I missed that second fatal frame. Did I? Girlfriend, get out of here. Ugh. Alright, one more round with you, please, and that is it. Ooh, ooh, ha. Ah! Oh. oh my god, I almost didn't fucking get that. Listen. Listen here, kid. I don't want to deal with you, okay? You're a little spooky spooky girl, and I don't like that. I don't much appreciate the spook- What the heck? I don't much appreciate this, okay? Is that how you've been getting me? You sneaky monkey? It's time no, it's not. Maybe it's time for you to go to sleep. Take a little nap. You kid? <gasps> okay, bye. Ah, shit. I hate being in these places. Something is here, though. Definitely not that way. Right here. How do I, uh... What angle do you want to be... Taking your picture with? There's definitely something, like, right here. You're a little tricky, aren't ya? Are you up here? 
It's like right here, I swear. Hmm. Nothing shows up though. How do I take this picture that you want me to be taking, probably? Do I have to go all the way around? Is there a way to do that? I don't think there is. Well, schnitzel. Usually these blue ones are like really important, you know? But it's not, it'll light up usually when I'm like in the right spot, but I can't really go backwards or forwards very much. And it's like in this spot here. I don't think it's on the ground. I feel like it's like right here. But there's no spots for me to take the picture in. Like it is so strong right here. But I I whip out my camera. Nothing. All right, maybe I'll come back to you later. <sighs> maybe I'll have to fight in here later. I really don't want to, but oh. Hey, girl, hey. That's spooky. Hopefully it's just something that's up here and not down there, and I, I was just catching a whiff of it down there. Because my filament is still out. Oh, maybe it is. Maybe it's this. Oh, it totally is. I could have probably gotten, like, a much better picture, but that's cool. Okay, that was it. That was totally it. Nobody get me! What is it? Light burning on the altar, there's, uh, where there is an offering on a wooden stand and two holly branches. Used for a ceremony? Mayhaps? Blood? This is, uh, this is very spooky. I don't much like this room. It's a little spooktacular. Where did this go? Not you! Oh god, oh god. Um. She's so spooky scary. Yes. Okay, good. <sighs> Dude, she's scary. I don't like you. I'm literally just running around as Miku and running into ghosts because I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, that's where that was. Oh. That makes so much sense. I'm pretty sure we still can't do Mio's- Mio, sorry. Mio's whole thing. Keep saying Mio because I'm mixing up Mio and Mayu's names. Because <laughs> they're twins. <laughs> and honestly, I always forget who is who. I think Mayu is the dumb one who goes for the butterflies and causes kind of the whole situation of the second game to happen. Is there gonna be a dude in here again? Nope, but there is an herbal medicine. That's very nice. And I think Mio is the one that survives it. Canonically. 
Listen, I don't I don't want your business. Where you at? 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 Where are you? I don't know where you're at, but I'm gonna um Okay, you're here somewhere. Purple Diary 2. His parting gift was a forbidden child. The child had handsome features just like he did. If he stays in this place, they'll cast him away once he turns four. I have to find a way to sneak him into the village below before then. If I give him the earring his father gave me, I'm sure someday he'll be able to come back. He'll be able to hear my voice. I may even be able to see his father again if he finds this earring. I'll name the child Kaname, uh, to symbolize our connection. Because I think Amane was the girl that snuck a man in or whatever. I know this child will come back with his father. I'm not a fan of your... Okay, thank you. I was going to say, I'm not a fan of your uh, soundtrack that you've got playing there. Where? Where should I be going? That's where I just came from, right? <sighs> Guess I'll just explore. Can I go in here? It's still sealed? Dang. I don't think I need to go in the rafters area. Maybe I do, though. Who knows? This is my only issue with Fatal Frame, is that, like... Uh, like, I know that I need to get the little stones, but I only know the location of one other one. I don't know where anything else is. We haven't seen it yet. And, like... I don't know, sometimes it's just a bit unclear where you need to go. And I get that it's cool, because then it's like, oh, but then you get to, like, I don't know, you get to, like, explore. And spooky things happen. And that's cool. But... I don't know, sometimes I just want to know, like, where I'm going. And sure, there might be things that get in my way, but sometimes I just want I just want to know where the fuck I'm going. And I feel like right now I have no idea. <laughs> I don't know where the fuck I'm going. Hello? I think I'm gonna go to the sound that I'm hearing down here. Because I know this one's open. And like, all I know is that we need to look for lullabies and stuff. I already knew this one existed. I don't know where the other two are. <sighs> Alright. Dirty stone green. Let's fight ghost. No? <gasps> I can just leave? She's just gonna let me leave with her stone? Really? Legit? Alright, I'm cool with it. Bye! Just wanted to make sure you were, like, really down with that, yo. But the- but it's still there. You can still hear it. Hmm. I'm gonna try this little door on the other side. Yeah, because now the filament is up and it's getting a little bit louder. Yeah, there's a thing on this door. Hello. Doll. Where is that again? Oh. Oh, um. How the fuck did I get up there? Is that through the... Is that through the bellflower door? No. Where the heck was that? This bellflower door has the stairs that go downwards, and there was a little peaky hole, but it... 
This one in particular had nothing around it. Where the fuck was that? Maybe it is in the room with past the hairbrushy lady. I might need to go back. What's through this door? What is through here? Leads into this area, which is the projection room. Got it. I could just go back through here, though. I'm pretty sure... Because you gotta, like... Go here. Right? No, 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 no. That's the library. What am I thinking of? This room? No, that's the other one. This room. That's the one I'm thinking of. Okay, yeah, so I think I do have to, uh... Did you go up, right? Go up here to the kimono room, and then you go in through the tiny door, I think. Tiny door somewhere over here. And then it leads you up to the little rafters up here. Yeah, it's a tiny door right here. Lead you up there, into that room. Okay, yeah. That is where I'm going. Um, so not that way. I don't think. I can just go back this way. Okay, so we've got half the stones so far, which is great. I just gotta make my way back. Past hairbrushy lady. Amane, I think. Pretty sure her name is not... Aname. Pretty sure it's Amane, right? But she named her kid Aname. Don't get me. Don't do it. I'm just passing through. I'm just a little lady passing through, okay? Okay. I'm here. Feel like I will probably be attacked by a ghost. But I hope I'm not. I will. I will be attacked by a ghost. Where the fuck are you? Where are you? Listen, I'm just gonna go. Is this a glitch? This might be a- never mind. Stay forever? I don't want to. Can I take a picture of you? <sighs> Alright. This is really scary, but also I'm not being attacked, so I'm cool with it. I wonder if that's a glitch. That's so weird. Okay, here we go. Not enough blood. Need more blood. No, oh, you. Okay, got it. Do I need to fight now? I don't want to. That person's gone. Bye! I think, right? I don't have the item here anymore. Yeah, it's gone. It's gone for good. Let's go. Okay, so we gotta go back to the tiny door in the tree courtyard. Oh, there's someone here this time, though. Oh, come on! <sighs> You're a traitor. Okay. 
I'm not, but thank you. She called me a traitor. I ain't never been here before. Until, like, a few nights ago, and then I, I didn't even choose to come here. Ah, <sighs> oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just walking real slow in a ghost-filled manner. You know how we do. I need to get some food in my tummy. I'm hungry. Okay, back down to the ground. Ugh. The thing that's a little spooky scary, I think, later on, is that, like, the ghost lady that's in that room, because this part connects to it, when you pass through the door, it doesn't- it doesn't close her off. Oh my god, what the fuck? Is there- is something glitching? My filament isn't even up. But the sound is there, like I'm being attacked. How weird! That is so weird. Alright. Hello, other shrine maiden. I am coming for your stone. Give me that stone, girl. Purity stone blue. Red cover. Red diary. Amane led a man into the Kuze shrine. The man woke the priestess from her dream. The Kuze code must be followed. She must be punished by impalement. She must not be let go. Anything else in here? Nope. Alright, let's get the fuck out, if they'll let me. Oh, and they will. How nice. How very kind of them. Uh, where to next? I can't... think of... I guess I can go to the projection room real quick. There's usually an item in there, and I think I have that reel that I can look at. Um... I would assume it's this room, but I don't know how to get the key for that yet. Hmm. Yeah, I'll go back to the projector room super fast. And I hope no one's here to get me. No go 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 ghosts. Unknown film. Oh. That is this room. Oh, oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Are you here? I mean, I know there was a ghost here before, but are you still here? 14 film, very nice, thank you. Okay, now I need to figure out where the heck I'm going, because I don't- I honestly don't know. Where is the fourth- where's the fourth little lady at? Where are you at, girl? Okay, so we have to go to that other space where Ray was like, uh, I can't fit in here. I'm- too much woman, and I can't fit. Miku is not that much smaller, I'm gonna be honest. Ray's pretty tiny, too. I mean, Ray's probably tall and Miku's, like, short, but... I don't think that has anything to do with whether or not either woman could fit in there, because they both feel like the same size woman, you know what I mean? Miku's just a little shorter. Anyways, there's a little corridor in here. A little pathway. We can hear it. Yeah, we can already hear it. Um, where was it, though? Okay. Where was it? Which wall? Oh, I have to go around once more. Okay. Here. Tiny door. This little area. Hi. Can I take a picture of you? Now nah, you're gone. Whoops. All right. 
Let's go forth. Elf. Nice. <sighs> this little area. Because Ray was like, oh no, I can't possibly fit in that gigantic two foot fucking hole. There's no way I could possibly even squeeze in there. I'm like two feet tall. I think I have to fight the crawling lady again. Oh shit! Ah, that's not what I wanted. Get off of me. Let me, uh, let me heal real quick, actually. I always press the slow one when I don't mean to press slow. Alright. Girl, where you at? Don't. Thank you. Look, I know that I could I could spend more time and use seven film and not have to waste fourteen film because fourteen film will probably come in handy like 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 really handy a lot later. But like, I, don't, I just don't want to deal with some of the ghosts. Some of them are just too scary. <laughs> I don't want to deal with them. Crawling lady always freaks me out. Also, <laughs> it always reminds me of this video. Um. I feel like it's probably a little impossible to find now, but in ye old early days of YouTube, there was this dude who played Fatal Frame with his friends, this one in particular. Uh, the video was called Fatal Frame Brad. <laughs> and it was literally Brad, I guess, with like his two friends and they're playing this area. I, although I think it was the first area where they have to fight the ghost and like, just the way that he screams is so fucking funny. <laughs> it was really, really good. It was really funny. And, uh... So every time I play the third game, I always think of Fatal Frame Brad. My mother told me that I have an older brother. His name is Kaname. And he lives in a house on the outside. In the Kuze house, they throw away boys, so he was sent outside. She told me many times that this was a secret. My brother has the same earring as my mother. They're beautiful earrings that she got from father. Mother gave it to him so that no matter where he is, he can hear her voice. I wonder if he can hear my voice, too. I want to see him. Deka was made into a priestess. I think that's the tattoo priestess's name. I always forget their names. But I'm pretty sure Deka is, um, the priestess. Tattoo one. She tells me about the outside. She says when she talks, the pain isn't as bad. I'm glad that I can be of some help. The priestess has an earring just like Mother's. Dun dun dun. She says it was a present from a good friend. So that she can hear his voice no matter where she is. I think that friend is Kaname. The priestess talks about him a lot. Yeah, that's her. The priestess seems kind of lonely. She formed an attachment. The jewel that I found in the room with the impaled dolls should fit perfectly in one of the indentations on the altar. Will the ghosties let me go? Uh oh. Door shut tight. Feels like something's pulling back from the other side. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay. Open the lock. Let me out. Oh, we're in the stair room. Oh, it's this little- Oh, give me this. 14 film? Yeah. Heck yeah. Heck yes, Juliet. <laughs> Hey, oh, no, 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 Oh, shit, 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 shit. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Oh, no, no, no. Shit. You know what? I... No, 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 no. I just don't. I just don't. I just don't. I don't. I don't want it. Can I, can I leave? Can you let me leave? Will you let me leave? Can I leave? Can I go? I don't want to... I don't want to do this. Let me go. Let me go. Fuck. No, I have to fight. Okay. Okay. Well, shit. Crap, 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 crap. Crap, crap. Crap. Ah. Oh. oh, schnitzel. Listen, when y'all gang up on me like this, it really hurts my feelings, okay? <laughs> I'm like so not into being bullied, like so hard not into it. No, 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 fuck. 
No, it's not. Stop it. Stop. Ah, fuck. God, you guys suck. Stop it. Listen. Listen to me. Listen. No, 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 no. Don't get my feet. Don't do it. Don't get my tootsies. These are my tootsies. I don't think I got her. Not in the right moment. Shit. Listen, I will take one more hit from y'all, and that's all the abuse I'm gonna take, okay? No, 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 no! Oh my god! Are you both right there? This is so fucking scary. I hate this. Stop, 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 stop. Oh, you guys were in sync. Oh my god, oh my god! I'm scared! Ah, shit, man. Get out of my face. Don't smile at me, you weirdo. This makes me so nervous. Okay, I didn't take that extra photo, but that works. Whoops. Stop hitting me in the tootsies. Oh my god. That was so spooktacular. Okay, okay. That sucked. I hated that. <laughs> okay, so I gotta get back to... Where the heck am I going? <laughs> I gotta get back to the rope room area, right? Right? Because don't we go through here? No, no, no. That's where I just was, wasn't it? No, apparently not. Fuck, where am I going? This map is so huge. I always forget. Um. Oh, we gotta go here. Right, we gotta go back to the altar room. Okay, so I have to make my way through there. Through there. Through here, if I can. And then just back. Oh, no, not even through there. Just right back through here. Okay. Go straight, keep to the right, and then the left. Got it. It'll let me through. Will ya? Thank you. Is it straight ahead here? No, it's to the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Down that little door. I think it would be kind of nice to have a Fatal Frame game where... the cameras aren't fixed. Okay, so it won't let me through there. Well, I don't need to go through there anyways. That's right, I gotta go down. I keep thinking that I have to go through there, but I don't. I don't know what you're saying, but I'm gonna ignore you. What'd you say? Sacrifice the mother, both of them? Kaname snuck in with the people who came to ease their pains. He said he wants to see the priestess, just once. It is against the code, but as she is going to have to perform the rite of commandment soon, she won't be able to leave again. I just want to- I just want- sorry, I want to help them meet, just once. Kaname went into the shrine, to the priestess place. Men cannot go into the shrine. I'm sure the mistress will be upset. Yeah... It's unfortunate. The jewel I found in the room with the impaled doll should fit perfectly in one of the indentations on the altar. Uh, in front of a small, shrine-like altar, there is mounted a pedestal with four indentations. Beneath the pedestal, ancient script is engraved. Yeah. I 
I don't know. Security blue left. Well, I would assume you go there. Oh, right. Both red. Try green. Okay. Switch them. So this one should be green. Sorry, that's not... That's not the one I meant to put on there. My bad. If she wakes up, perform the rite of stakes unless you want the doors to open up and be all like, bleh. There you go. Handmade song resounds through the area. Resounds, resound. Is she free? The mechanism begins to move and the suspended cell is raised upwards. I should be able to enter from the upper level. Not this person. No, 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 no. Okay. Um, 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 um. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Where? 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 Oh my God. Ah, fuck. Okay. 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 No, that's wrong, that's wrong. Oh my god, I'm so scared. No, fuck! How did that hit me if I did it? Okay, good. I probably could've used 14, but like, whatever. Hand, hand, hand ghosts are scary. <sighs> oh my gosh! That was so spooky! Oh my gosh. Ah, okay. Miku's dream again. There's old film in the camera. <sighs> and the spirit radio. Have I even gotten any stones to listen to the spirit radio yet? No, I guess not. Well then. Am I hearing... something from Miku's room? Miku, you're awake. What's up, girl? I'm gonna wait to talk to you, though. Okay, I wanna develop my film. Um... First? I think we're only, like, halfway through the game right now. Let me do this film. Then I'll give you a little chit chat. Look at all this film I got. Beautiful, wonderful. 
Tattooed skin on the altar. Yeah, that's gross. And that's... Oh, the crawling ghost. Right. Crawling woman is a scary ghost. I can't... I don't know if she was the one that was in the dream in the attic space. Or if, um... If that was Yoshino. Hey, girl, hey! Miku. Mafuyu. Miku? Oh, no, it's nothing. I just had another bad dream. <sighs> well? Cool. Are you awake? Do you want to do some research? While I apparently do nothing all day? Fucking OBS. Rose again, but I walked down. Miku said something, but I don't know what she said. Okay. Here. She had said something, but I don't know what she said because when this thing freezes, the sound stops completely. So I saw her mouth moving and nothing came out. And I was like, wait, what? What did you say? And then I looked over and there it was frozen. Um, Ray, about that photo of the doll on the skewer, I wasn't able to find anything on it. I thought it might be similar to Legends of the Straw Dolls passed, in, passed on in Tono. Anyway, it has something to do with folklore, so you might find something in one of Yu's books. Okay. Thanks, I'll go take a look. Ray, I, I was interested myself, so I did some research on that lullaby. You were interested in it too, right? I was. In the mountains of the Mits Mutsu region, uh, there's an old lullaby that was only passed to certain villages. Sleeping Priestess, verse 1. Sleep, child, go to sleep. If you cry the boat, you'll ride the boat to the other side. Once you get there, the bib you shall wear, and you will be punished should you fail to lie still. Within the same mountain chain, the song of the Sleeping Priestess was only trans transmitted to a certain number of villages. The dissemination is thought to be dependent on elements such as the village's roads and location. As the usage of the word priestess implies, the song is thought to have its origins in indigenous folk rites, given its method of transmission. As for the lyrics themselves, the opening line, sleep child, go to sleep, calls the child into sleep. Uh, the next part, if you cry, the boat you'll ride, the boat to the other side, uses words like boat and the other side, which is suggestive of banishment or death. Um, it can be taken as a stanza of a threatening song, which is to frighten the child into sleep. The bib you shall wear can be understood to depict you will be dressed up to go. After should you fail to lie still, the inclusion of the frightening words you will be punished impresses admonition upon the child. Perhaps as the once ceremonial song changed into a lullaby, it metamorphosed into the threatening song so common in the Mutsu area. Sleeping Priestess verse 2. Sleep child, go to sleep. If you should wake from your slumber at night, great wooden stakes shall pin you down tight, lest the doors wide open and the others that sleep wake too. In the second... Sorry, the second verse develops in a very similar way and makes use of the same elements. If you should wake threatens that if the priestess should wake during the ceremony, and the lullaby this means sleep, the woken priestess or child will have their limbs pinned by stakes. These great wooden stakes may be a remnant of a religious phrase. At the last part, lest the doors open wide and the others that sleep wake too, there is a shift from a familiar story centering on the priestess child to an uneasy end, both vague and large in scale. It is thought that this expresses religious fear, such as dread of the underworld. Basically. Thanks, I'll just borrow this for a bit. Legend songs. If you need anything else, just let me know. Will do. Uh, can I get your help? It seems like you're having a lot of nightmares lately. Are yeah, but can... Right? Is there something? Yeah. I have a few. I have a few photos. I would like for you to have them. I'll let you know if I find anything. Okay. I think that's all of them, right? Oh, I got a package. Is it from Kay? Yeah. Miku must have brought it in for me. 
Letter from Kay. Dear you, the cassette tapes I had restored are finished now, so I'm sending them. My tape player broke, so I can't listen to them, but apparently they were in pretty bad shape, so even though they've been restored, they may be hard to hear. In the dream I had the other day, I saw Mio deep in the manor. It looked like she was after her missing sister Mayu. I guess it has weighed on me. When I wake, the pain and the tattoo spread, just like the story says. If I don't hurry, I may also go missing, like the urban legend says. This may be it for my investigation. Once I get off the mountain, I'll give you a call. Okay. There are two cassettes. Same dream two. Same dream three. Let's give them a listen. Whoops, this is the wrong... Sorry, I went straight to the spirit radio. Kind of a habit, honestly. Uh, two and three. Yes, I... I don't want to sleep. Ever again. There were a lot of people in the courtyard. The people... They... They were tying this person up with ropes. And, and then they wrapped them in white cloth. They were burying the, but, but it looked like the one being tied up seemed to be doing it voluntarily. Afterwards, they, they put a big rock on them, a big log, like a skewer. There's a song. It's coming from inside the manor. <laughs> Children are singing and laughing. At first, uh, at first, I saw my wife. I just wanted to see her one more time. I went inside. Oh, I'm so tired now. So, so tired. The snow. That guy's voice kind of sounds like the the voice of the radio slash baby thing in the PT demo. Like, they sounded very similar. I can hear it. I can't make out what they're saying, but, but, but I can hear something. It's the same dream. Wait, 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 no, 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 it's, it's not the same. It's, it's different somehow. I'm going further in. They're, they're calling me. I can hear their voices. No, no, I, I can't, I can't tell what they're saying. It's, they're just calling me. Now, it's snowing. There's a, there's a big, quiet manor. It seems like, like there's a funeral, and everyone's face is hidden. It, 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 uh, Oh, wait. I'm going in deeper. Deeper. It's, it's almost suffocating. I, I, I can't breathe. So sorry. <laughs> I have such a childish mind. <laughs> I didn't do anything. She did it. No, no, no. It, it can't be. Help, it's not me. It's not my... Well, damn, son. I think he might be dead. I'll just save really fast. I think... We're going to enter a new chapter, which means the end of an episode. <gasps> Are we going to play as K? Yep, that's Sai. Yeah, 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 we're playing as K. I was going to say Miu and, and, uh... Miu and Mayu were... were... holding hands. Chapter Hour 8.
They were holding hands just like uh, Yai and Sai were in the second one. Um, but yeah, that will be it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for joining, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!